When I was a little girl, I was fascinated with the stained glass windows and mosaics I saw every time I went to church. It didn't matter that I saw these same images every week. I was drawn to them and mesmerized throughout the entire Mass. This was especially true when I had the opportunity to see the relic of the Black Madonna in Częstochowa, Poland. To see all the devout Catholics making their pil pilgrimage, to see this holy shrine was really awe-inspiring. It was such an incredible, prayerful atmosphere that was filled with reverence and love for God. It struck me that you didn't have to follow what I thought were the rules for prayers. You didn't have to kneel or say something memorized. I was surrounded by people who came to talk to God in every way imaginable. We generally think of prayer as something we read, say, or listen to. But prayer can also be a visual experience. As the saying goes, a picture is worth a thousand words. Images and all forms of visual arts can offer a rich dimension and meaning that can't be duplicated in words and adds to the prayer experience. Art has a long history within the Christian church. Paintings, tapestries, sculptures, mosaics, stained glass, and other images and icons were one of the first ways the common people could understand the stories of Christianity. For thousands of years, oral and visual traditions were the main ways that people were exposed to the Bible and the Christian faith. The result is a wide variety of religious artworks in every style and media from which we can draw inspiration. So today, we will try Visio Divina as a starting point for our prayer. Visio Divina means divine seeing and invites one to encounter the divine through images. Using a piece of art as a focal point, we can engage in prayer, reflection, and meditation. I have an image here that I really like, but remember, art is personal, so there is no right or wrong way to do this. So first, we'll pick out an image that you like, either from a website, a photograph, or a painting. Now look at the image and let your eyes stay with the first thing you see. Keep your attention on that one part of the image. Just gaze at it for a minute or so. Now let your eyes take in the whole image. Reflect on every part. Now think about the following questions. What does this image bring forth in you? What emotions do you feel? Does this image lead you into an attitude of prayer? If so, let those prayers take shape. You can write them down if you prefer. Now offer your prayers to God in a few moments of silence. I invite you to find an image to inspire prayer. Perhaps you already have something in your home, or look up a picture online, or simply look around you the next time you're in church. Prayer is about talking and listening to God, so don't worry about the right way to pray. Just talk to God, even while you're looking at a picture.